Hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. So listen, let me come in with this real quick, right? So I was sitting in this establishment and I overheard these people talking about the classic. So, I mean, they were in mixed company. And if, if you all understand what I'm saying, they were in mixed company. So it was mixed company sitting at the table. And um, the um, server, or the waitress had came over and the one of the people sitting at the table was like, tell her what the Magic City classic is like, what the classic is like. So the girl was like, yeah, it is loud, it is ratchet. It's like the Auburn, Alabama game turned up times 10. You really can't get any reception out there. Um, it's just a whole lot of people. It's crowded. It's loud. It's noisy. Okay. Now, the reason I'm making this video is because what i learned from that it is it is all about perception how you perceive things because the young lady sitting the other young lady she was like i told you i told you it's loud it's ratchet it's just a lot of ratchet people but has she asked me what the magic city classic is like i necessarily want to say that as a matter of fact i know that half of the stuff she said i would not have said for example it is crowded it is a lot of people it is loud it is noisy you're not going to get any reception but did she fail to tell her the hundreds and thousands of alumni that come out the support the camaraderie all of the families that are out there that are getting together that are barbecuing all of the the love and the joy that's out there all of the people who are who plan for this year you know from the last year coming together so that they can be with their people all of the people who've come and made an investment so that they can enjoy um their schools did they talk about did she say talk about the legacies that are passed on how generations of families are out there no why because it's all about your perception and that is my nugget for today and i'm gonna take i'm gonna take this i'm gonna give um uh, my overseer his due for this quote i'm gonna discern and dismiss okay because everything is not worth letting enter into your ear gates and because they were in mixed company this girl who know, the perception that she's gonna have now of the magic city classic is tainted and we have got to watch how we're looking at things how we're perceiving things are you perceiving the glass as half empty or are you perceiving it as half full are you saying that you're broke busted and disgusted or are you saying i am next in line for a blessing god did it for my brother my sister he's gonna do it for me next are you saying that i'm preparing i'm um god is positioning me for my next breakthrough it is on the way i'm just trying to see what are you saying out of your mouth and let me tell you i'm i'm guilty ouch and amen of having to stop regroup regather and pull every wicked thought into captivity that is not in the likeness and the mindness of christ so that's my tip for bit for today courtesy of amr over the overseer discern and dismiss Take the meat, throw away the ball. Everything is not worthy of entering into your ear gates. All right, guys.